What's up guys, you already know, this your girl, you already know, I'm late, I'm, I'm late, I'm late, I'm late, I'm late, make sure y'all follow me on my YouTube channel. Hey guys, it's your girl, I'm back, I'm back with another video. I don't know what, this is, I think this is the third day, fourth day of Craftman. I'm not doing Bogman, I'm doing Craftman, it's Craftman with an M-A. That's at the end. So it's crafting. It's the same thing. But everything that I'm going to be doing in my videos are going to be dealing with like some type of DIY, some type of crafting, making things, updating y'all on different information. Y'all update me on things. So make sure y'all stay tuned. Y'all stay locked in. And I do have another video coming up on AI that I did get. I put up a post and I asked and I did get a, a few response on here and on Instagram so and Facebook. So, yes, I will be doing the AI. I already started um, already started recording it. So, I just have to put it together. So, that video will be coming out real soon. So, make sure you subscribe to the channel. You locked in with your girl. So, that way, you know every time your girl is dropping a video. So, until then... um. This video today, I'm going to be making a couple of um, memorial pieces dedicated to my office manager that we lost, which is a great guy. I wanted to show you a one. I had already made one, but I don't even know where it disappeared to. Uh, probably one of my cousins took it. It was one that I made of my mom. But anyway, um, that that was a, um, it was the angel a ornament that you put on your tree. And this is how it looks. Let me see if I can show you. Okay. So it's an angel. It comes like this. And you see the little round piece. The picture goes on there. And then you put it on the angel wing. And then it and then you can hang it up like on your tree. And this is something that's good because you can use this like you don't have to do this one all year round. Like, you don't have to just put it up for your Christmas tree. You can, like, literally, um, you can literally, like, leave it up all year round. You can put it on, you can hang it up, like, on your wall, your computer. That's what I had mine. I actually had mine on my computer, um, like, hanging right over my, um, webcam. That's why I'm like, okay, like, where did it go? If I can get this open, I'll show you. Oh, here we go. How it look. But, um, so yeah, I'm going to make a few of these. And then I'm going to make some, um, some buttons. And this is, and you see, this is how it is. Where's the string? There we go. So this is how it is. And... The picture goes in the middle. And you could, like I said, you could hang it up on your tree during the Christmas time. Let your loved ones know that they're always here with you. You're always thinking of them. Or you can just um, hang them up, like I said, all year round. Um, I had did this. Um, I had made this. Um. last year of my mom but i didn't do the measurements correct well actually i did the measurements but it shifted these right here i'm really if i do these these is just like something just as a little gift because i really don't like it to um to chain you know it's, it's really not real and it changed even though I did it like a year, but I could still see the difference in the change that it, like the coloring. So I'm not too much, I'm not a big fan of these, but I do have them. So I will still use them like as giveaways and things like that. So yeah. And then I'm going to, I have these, I'm going to make some of these. I had these for a while. My sister sent them to me like... Mm, a while ago months back and these 
like they're the but the button. So if you don't have the button on um, maker machine, you can still do um buttons, customize um memorial buttons, party buttons, whatever you need to do the buttons for. You can still do them with these. They're clear, and you can use um card stop. You can print do print your stuff on card stop, regular like printing paper, but you want to make it thick. And you put it in there and then close it. Then there you have it. So I am going to do some of these. So I'm going to show you how I'm going to make it. I'm actually going to um print these out and and crick it. Normally, I'm a, I'm a Canva girl. I love me some Canva. But because of these, I'm going to do them and crick it. So I'm going to show you all. How I made it. I'm going to use a round circle and Cricut. And then um, the measurement is 2.4. And um, we're going to make them. We're going to put the picture in it. And then we're going to print out. So I'm going to set y'all up so y'all can see um, the process. And um, yeah. Thank you for rocking with you, girl. I appreciate y'all. So let me set y'all up. Alright guys, so now I'm here in Cricut Design Space and I'm just going to make the the um, image, or well, not make the image, I'm just going to um, print and cut out the image. So I'm just going to grab a circle and then I'm going to keep the box locked. I'm just going to size it and I'm going to pull up the, um, the designs that I want and what I'm going to do is I'm going to push the circle behind it and then I'm just lining it up and lining it up to make sure it's even. I got it where I want and then I'm going to come down. I'm going to slice it. Once it's sliced, there you see it. So now I have the image and I'm going to repeat the same thing. I'm going to push the image to the, the circle to the back, cut it out. Same thing. And the circle that I'm using for the for the pieces that I'm using are I believe they are 2.4 and I'm making 10 of each so what you see me doing all I did was just made them and I just connected them so when I printed out they'd be all on that one sheet so now I'm doing the image of my mother is and that what I'm making the image is basically the same the same size so i'm able to use the same circle i did the same process <clears throat> cut it out and i and for what i'm doing this angel is double-sided so you could um put an image on both sides even though only one side gonna show unless you want to make the image uh, well put the button down low so then i took it over to cricut to my um cut machine i let it cut out and it was a change of plans, guys. So when I after I took it off, then I realized the the machine had cut cut some like cut on some of the images. So I ended up reprinting it and then decided to cut it out. But when I um cut it out for some reason, guys, I don't know. I don't I didn't like the way that that it looked in it. So I'm gonna play around with it a little bit more because I wanted to be up a little closer that more three D effect. So I put that to the side and I decided to get it and make my angel um, wing. And as you see, all I did was just prepping everything. I took it out the bag. I'm just cutting it down. Then I'm just going to tape it. And then I um, pressed it at, um, most likely everybody pressed it at 460 degrees. But because of that, I just, I pressed it, I believe it was like three, three, um, I want to say 390 for like 45 no 390 for the 60 second I did the whole 60 second I just didn't put it at 400 normally I do my 400 for 60 second I did it for 400 I mean 390 390 for 60 second and as you see I did both sides but you're only going to be able to see one and um yeah guys so I I like it. It's an angel, like the it's a it's supposed to be like a ornament, but the way that it's made, you can actually use it more than you can use it more than Christmas time. The way that 
it is you you can hang it up like say you put it on your tree you can take it off your tree you take down your tree you can hang it up like on your wall because i normally keep mine hung up on my um on my computer on the desktop computer like so it's always dear in my face but you can like hang it up anywhere or you don't have to even hang it up you can like place it like on a table or something like that but it has the little hook as you can see where you can hang it up because most people you know you hang it up during christmas time and i think i'm gonna show you at the end i did hang mines up on my little tree on my desk at work i took it to work because i feel like at my job it's less like a doubt a, a a dark cloud over so i feel like let me make a you know something happy to make me happy and so as you see this is how it looks and it's so beautiful and you have a loved one that you want to you know always keep close to your heart and you feel that that's your angel this is the way to go guys get you an angel heart let me know what's your thing i'll meet you down in the comments talk with your lady